off. <laughs> Hi, welcome back to Team Mom. Mommy and Faith. Woohoo! You missed that one, man. Yes, sorry. I did. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, so today we this is different, and I'm I don't know. Have you seen this anywhere? I haven't seen this. No, I haven't seen this. Um, not even for any other method. No, I don't know. No, you just came up with this. So I'm like, I know y'all are like, what are they talking about? Okay, so we are sitting outside of our local Golden Corral. It's not really local. It's kind of far away. But anyway, it's not. Um, we're sitting outside of our one of our local Golden Corrals, my and I chopped off. Um, it, <laughs> my head is chopped off. Okay, so anyway, don't mind her. We, um, I have been thinking ever since you know coronavirus hit um and you know just being in the house when all everything was shut down and then things started opening back up and then you know boom golden corral's open and we passed golden corral you know as we're you know going from place to place and whatever and we've seen quite a few cars yeah like in they're the open parking lot and it's scary 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 mary and um and i've just been wondering it. how golden corral is not contributing to the spread of COVID-19. I mean, right. as you know, Golden Corral is a self-serve buffet. Um, like, how are they ensuring that everybody's clean as they're using their, you know, as they're make, making their plate? Like, how? I don't understand. I don't understand we, how it so works. So, we were just curious, and this has been something we've been wondering for months and months. Right. And months. So, today... We have we we're in the car we're in the parking lot blah 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 we have a we have some questions yeah, that we want to know we want to know these are just really simple questions that they should be able to answer easily and right. you know every employee should know this like right. because there has to be there's Trumpies out there and there's people who wonder uh, maybe I shouldn't say Trumpies but anyway but there are people who are gonna wonder this and um there are Trumpies who aren't gonna care right so we are currently out like I said outside the the Golden Corral we're gonna um. Go ahead and give them. Oh my god! I mean, there's they're selling cotton candy. Okay, so there's there's this couple or two people walking. They have their mask on, um, and they have two pieces of or two bags of a uh, cotton candy. Yeah, but maybe the cotton candy is already made. Right, maybe it's already in bags because they we already know that they have lots of desserts in their cups and things. So are they having them in plastic cups instead of the glass ones or what's going on? Yeah. So we're gonna use my phone since we're recording on hers and we're gonna use my phone call and then we'll ask the questions and then we'll go inside and i'm kind of confused about this part but we're gonna go inside and just see for ourselves if what they tell us on the phone is what's actually happening um so just to kind of as of today saturday um what's today january the 30th 30th <laughs> Um, North Carolina, because that's where we are, stats, COVID stats, there's over, I think, 750,000 cases of COVID-19, and um, over, I think, like, Sorry. Sorry. hey, thank you, over, like, 9,000 deaths, I think, I'm not 100% sure about the deaths, but either way, COVID is running rampant, and, you know, we have to do what we can to stay safe, so, you know, just remember to always stay masked. Yes. Uh, wash your hands and wait at least uh, six, six feet, feet apart. apart. I mean, from, from people. and don't do big gatherings. They're not necessary. There's Zoom. That we're so lucky that there's Zoom, Google Hangouts, FaceTime, whatever, that we can contact our friends that way. So if you can, if they have the, if you have the ability to contact your friends through some mobile device, through whatever. Yeah, absolutely. Do that instead of meeting somewhere, instead of risking your lives, risking their lives, and risking right. the lives of others. And I'm not going to sit here and say that we haven't eaten out at restaurants during this time. We have. We but it's have. better to take out. Yeah, I mean, we generally we take out. Um, mm -hmm. We've sat down in restaurants. I could probably count on like one hand how many times I've personally sat down um, in a restaurant to eat. Mm -hmm. Um and I've not ever it's been. Yeah, it's, I've it's, never been to a um, a buffet during this time. So I'm, gener I'm, that's why I'm we're genuinely so curious. curious about how this works <laughs> and how they ensure that people are <laughs> adhering to COVID nineteen regulations. That they're not um, they're not 
uh, contributing, that's what we're looking for, contributing to the spread of COVID-19. And so, um, <laughs> I'm like, she, I just she's say, prepared. I have three hand sanitizers in my bag. Yeah, you can't ever be too Two prepared. masks. I mean, as you can see back there, we've got some hand sanitizing wipes. wipes and um, we have some up here and uh, everywhere, it's, all in the car because you got to be sure, you got to stay safe, you got to make sure. Yeah. I mean, and as we're here, I just see more and more people pulling up. Um, but we're going to go ahead. It's not so bad. I thought it was going to be a little bit worse because it's uh, Saturday, but it turns out maybe it's not that bad. So we got to. Oh, do you want me to look it up? Yeah, I got it. You got it? I'll just do it. Just don't do it verbally. You got to type it out. Yeah. All right. So while she's getting the number, like I said, like we said, we're going to give give them a call. So far, when we see people coming in and or out, everyone seems to have a mask. So that's good. Um, if you've never been to a Golden Corral um, or you haven't been, I don't know, maybe in the last 10, 15, 20 years, um, <laughs> Golden Corral is a self-serve buffet. Um, is this the right one? Let me see. It is a self-serve buffet. Have, you have a little... No, child. Me, where, where is your maps google maps at oh <laughs> what are you looking through sorry i'm doing it on anyway so um you know people go up to the buffet um they fix their own food oh you're um, talking about normally yeah i mean that's how golden corral as okay, a buffet works go. um so we're gonna give them a call go ahead and we're is gonna put call? it is that call right here we're gonna put this on speak room yes so that everyone can hear. How do you? I got it. Yeah. I, okay. Thank you for calling Golden Corral. For curbside pickup okay. arrival, please press one. To place a GC on the go order, please press two. So it seems like you have to have for directions. Please an press order three. Or, or like to and do to a speak takeout. To a manager, please press four. You do it in advance. To repeat this menu, please press five. Thank you, and have a good day. Well, that was kind of weird. Thank you for calling Golden Corral. For curbside pickup arrival, please press 1. Hmm? To place a GC on the go order, I don't know if this please... is the right number. We'll try. I can see the questions. Oh, right there. Golden Corral Cocktail. This is Anna here speaking. How may I help you? Um, yes, hi. I was calling because I am interested in coming to eat at Golden Corral. Um, is it just normal come in or do you have to have a reservation? Uh, I didn't get you. Can you just speak a little bit louder? Um, yes, ma'am. Hi. Can you hear me now? Yes. I was calling. I'm interested in coming to Golden Corral today to eat. Is it normal just come in or do you have to have a reservation? No, you have to come in. We're open for dining. Okay, perfect. So I would like to know how is Golden Corral adhering to COVID-19 restrictions? Okay, so you have to have a mask. And when you get here, we have sanitizers. You have to sanitize your hands. We have gloves to hold, that you can wear to hold spoons. Or maybe you can use the tissues. We use the tissues to hold the spoons while you're serving on your plate. Okay, so masks are required for both employees and customers? Yes. So what if a customer comes without a mask? Okay, can you please? I'm sorry, what was that? Off. I don't hear you. Yes, ma'am. If a customer comes and they do not have a mask, what do y'all do? If, if you don't have the mask, we don't, you, we don't allow you to get in. Okay. So there's no, you can't refuse to wear a mask. Is that correct? Okay. Yeah, you have to wear a mask. And if you don't have one, we sell them for one dollar here. Okay. Thank you for that. And, and, and the buffet is still self-serve. Is that correct? Yes. The buffet is self-serve. And are y'all still offering yes. takeout? Can you come in and make a takeout plate? Yeah, you can do takeout too if you want. So we can just come in to make a takeout plate? Yes, you come in. We have uh, containers here. You go, you fill up your food, and then you wait on the scale. One pound is six ninety-nine. Okay. Well, thank you so much. And what time are y'all open till today? Till 9 
going to open two nine. All right, perfect. Thank you so much for the information. You are welcome. Have a good day. You too. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. Thoughts. So it seems like they're doing okay. Like verbally, right? They're saying, "Oh, we're doing this. We're doing that." It seems like they said you can either wear a mask to i mean sorry you can either wear um gloves to to prepare your food or she sounded like she said a tissue, a tissue. or something like so, that so which is first thoughts but that might not be being um adhered to very much like people may be um not, using their bare hands still right also i don't okay it's the one ladle thing like or the one right that's a little weird for me, and some people are like, well, it's not touching your mouth. Yes, I know, but there's germs, and if people aren't using the whatever that they should be using, like, I don't know, maybe they'll have people supervising, but they, you know, we didn't really ask, but... Right, so what we're going to do now, we're going to get our coats and get our masks. Like we said, wearing a mask is very important, so we both have our masks. <laughs> it's like wearing our mask. We're gonna put our mask on and we're going to go in and pretend like we're going to get some uh takeout when they they're like have a nice day we come come out empty handed yeah we're not gonna really like we i don't really want to eat here no we're not gonna eat here we're i don't have walk, the best we're gonna walk around like we are wanting to get some food we'll see how it goes we'll have like um, an entire plate with us like, yeah, potentially we'll see how it goes we're gonna take you on this visit as well so that we can all see visually see what's going on and then when we get back we will uh just have a little follow-up yes one last disclaimer thing is i know i've had friends who are like i just don't know what kind of mask to get like they always fall on my face and yeah, 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 yeah. there are different kinds of masks the one that i have has like one of the uh sizable mm-hmm same here thing so it's good you know if your ears are if, it, if your face if, you know if it's not covering your face or it's tight you know you can loosen but obviously don't have it to where it's not actually right. covering your face that's not actually wearing a mask correctly but yes yeah. um do you want me do you just i think we should have one plate thing and then i'll just vlog well you're not gonna actually say anything we're just yeah, gonna walk around and record yeah. um but first we're just gonna go in and see and then we'll just you know have the camera up we're not going to keep it on the little thing no 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 we'll just have it yeah in our hands exactly I'm all right drink, so yeah but you might not because you might not be able to hear you right and we don't want to make it very very obvious what we're doing, right? we'll give our thoughts when we come back exactly see you all right so we're out and we're about to go into our local Golden Corral. Like I ain't, we weren't lying. We was not playing about what we doing. And I'm just gonna hold it weird just lie. like this. Uh, waste ten minutes talking about what we're going to do, calling, and then not <laughs> yeah. being there. Be like, we'll come back tomorrow. No, we're oh. right here. Okay. I have my rules and I'm all good to go. So here we go. We're gonna say we want to get take out. Sorry, who's Somebody, I guess. I don't understand. I guess you get your stuff made. Okay, okay. On the go. Oh, first. I was gonna say the first, but. Yeah. So. Welcome to Golden Club. Hi. If we want to do takeout, how do you do that? We want to do takeout. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can do so. We have the containers here. Okay, can we see what they have on there? Yes. Okay. Okay. Right, shoot. Here, hold it. So they have hand sanitizer out front. Like they said they would. This is good. And that we're allowed to walk around beforehand. You can do Yes. Oh, Alright, let's go look. Let's go.
Enough footage. Like, they probably can't even hear you. What do you? Oh, <laughs> yeah, they can. Anyway, it's fine. But as you guys saw from the previous clip, so all right, my our assessment is. I mean, yeah, they're trying, but right, of course okay. they can't guarantee. For Golden Corral's sake, we did see a guy say, "Hey, remember to use the napkin or the gloves." Which I didn't see no gloves. Where were the gloves at? I don't know, but napkin. And, um, you know, so he was trying to find who's going to hear you? Huh? people, and as we who really don't care what others say or COVID protocols or the lives of others. So, you know, I, I, they're trying their hardest, but there's always more that can be done. It's, you know, but, um, we did, okay. Hold on, I'm going to pause. So, before we, I already did some, but before we, um, right. continue, hand sanitizer. See, si, senorita. Is that good? Yes. That's absolutely wonderful. Okay. So. Stress relief, because I, I Our assessment of Golden Corral. Um, mm, I wouldn't eat there. Uh, personally. <laughs> there were quite a lot of people there. That, like, it, I mean, it's it really was, actually not that busy for no. a Golden Corral. Like, right. For Golden but Usually, I mean, it's four thirty-ish right now. I mean, it's really not that busy. I was I like, like Shoot, we should have came during dinner time when it was a whole bunch more people. Um, but I mean, there's people walking around without masks. There's people walk um, serving their food without. We mm -hmm. um, saw family without a mask. Without napkins. Mm -hmm. Most and there's not an attendant napkins. per se to to say to like, okay, please. if people don't use a napkin, to immediately wipe it off or immediately switch it with a new one right there's there's nothing like that um yeah um uh it was kind of what i expected um they you know what they said on the phone was pretty much true but everything that they said that they were trying to do i think i saw except for the masks um I don't know if they thought, well, we're going to go get seconds, it'll be really quick, or whatever. Obviously, the only people that weren't wearing masks were the ones that were eating. Yeah. Um, but some people might have had it on the table next to them. I mean, dirty. you can't eat and wear a mask. So that's, no, but that's I, I usually try, unless it's like a really messy food, to um, just keep my mask still on my face to quickly be able to put it up if I have a waiter or... Yeah. Uh, uh, quickly put it up if I have a waiter or if I need to just like whatever 
Mm -hmm. That's what I tried to do personally. I'm just saying. Um, but putting it on a dirty table, not the smartest move. No, absolutely I would, not. you know, tuck it in my purse or put it in my pocket or and put it on my lap. Not to say that any of those places are good because, like, especially like on your lap, you may forget, stand up, boom, your mask is on the floor. Very true. Very true. Um, but yeah, I I definitely would not eat in there. I mean, Faith was talking about how she was having anxiety even being in there. <laughs> I felt really like <laughs> claustrophobic. I was like, no. You felt what? Claustrophobic. You felt what? Claustro. Cla claustrophobic. Claustrophobic? Claustrophobic. Cla mm -hmm. Claw. Whatever. Claustrophobic. We'll edit that out. <laughs> I don't want to. No, we're going to keep that. No! <laughs> but yeah, but I, claustrophobic I, because, yeah. I don't know, I just like there were a lot of people in there. And I don't, since COVID, I've just been like, I can't breathe. Like, mm -hmm. I, I don't like having a mask on in general. Nobody yeah. does. But I wear it because, you know, it's the safest and the best thing to do. But I'm like, I can't breathe. And I don't know if it was all the people being in there, but I just felt like we were all sharing air. And I was like, <laughs> this limited air that is coming through this mask, plus all these people being here, I just felt like this tension. Yeah. I mean, I definitely, like I said, I wouldn't eat there because of just the mere fact you can't trust everybody to do what's right. You can't trust everybody to have wash their hands use the sanitizer um to use a napkin when they're um grabbing the utensils uh it, you can't trust any of that right like and the fact that okay you don't know if somebody just did use their bare hands to grab it and now i'm coming behind them to grab it i wouldn't even that would be too much anxiety for me granted you don't know what people are doing when you go to a restaurant and they're Very they're true. making they your food, they could be spitting in your food. Yeah, you don't know any of that stuff. I but mean, you, you, you you hope none of that stuff. Right, at least, and you try to trust. Right, at least that it's the people that work there, and for the most part, you would hope that they have to adhere to the COVID regulations. Um, so you can feel a little bit more safer that way. Um, but again, like I said, we haven't really been going out to eat. We have been doing takeout because. Uh, your, your girl type cooking like <laughs> i we were good for the first few months you know in quarantine right things. it was like this but, is our this is our time this is our chance you know yeah. to us uh, try new recipes try to be the next uh, uh top of show i i didn't think that not not one i mean like i definitely appreciated the being able to kind of get this time in with faith and to practice my cooking skills but it got old it got old real quick it's only certain things that i, I can't cook that i can know how to cook <laughs> and then just keep cooking the same we thing like over, and over and over and over again <laughs> yeah like i was like uh this is not a trial and error this is a trial get it right and continue doing it right <laughs> so i think that our final assessment is we won't be eating that golden the grill and if you don't really care about that certain thing, that's, you, that's fine. Go, you, go, we're not saying that go you ahead. shouldn't go. You know what I'm saying? Please. You do whatever you feel like right. is, is, is going to be your mm -hmm. good for you. But if anything, if you're going to go into Golden Corral, if you're not going to use a napkin, uh, whatever they have for you to grab the utensils with, then at least, the bare minimum, wash your hands, use hand sanitizer, both works better than anything and yeah. you wear a mask like we cannot yeah. pressure that enough yeah we definitely wear a mask, that enough. Wear I, a I mask. feel so stupid and for saying claustrophobic and claustrophobic and when i sound like i cannot pressure this like enough. colossal that's what it sounded like you were saying colossal phobic <laughs> basically i was like she was like and i kept saying it like i was like i know this is the right word i feel like i was i mean she in. was she was close I, w I had 95% of the word correct. Yeah, but no. I just said cola. Like, claw. Doesn't matter. I just. Anyway. <laughs> so, yeah. That was that was our adventure for today. Yeah, and that's enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> so, now we going back home to where it's <laughs> safe. put on my pajamas. In our little bubble, right? Yeah. And, uh. I'll probably go eat Take a shower. Like, oh, you, know, you know, be like, here's my spaghetti. Here's yeah, my, you that know. was made and prepared by my hands in our kitchen. And clean vegetables, clean mm -hmm. sausages. 
Amen. Not having to worry about anybody else having to have touched all over it, breathed all over it, anything like that. Um, so yeah, that is today's edition of Team Mommy and, and Faith. Faith. Woohoo! Catch y'all next time. Don't forget to subscribe. Yo, that's right. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button. Comment below <laughs> what you want us to do. And uh I think that's it. Yeah. Boom. Thank y'all.